Space ice cream machine operation. Assembly. Insert the scraper blade from this side. Ensure they are securely placed on the beater. Lubricate the drive shaft gasket. Slide it onto the drive shaft. Install the drive shaft onto the beater. Place the beater assembly inside the cylinder and rotate it to ensure the drive shaft is properly seated with the rear of the machine. Dispensing door assembly. Slide the O-rings onto the draw valve, ensuring they are properly positioned in their grooves. For the middle draw valve, use an H-ring. Lubricate all three draw valves to ensure smooth operation. Snap the star caps onto the dispensing door. Insert the draw valves into the dispensing door. Fit the dispensing door gasket into the grooves on the back of the door. Install the three handles. Place the beater guide onto the dispensing door. Install the dispensing door assembly onto the machine. Tighten the four dispensing door nuts, placing the long nuts on top. Cross-tighten the four nuts. There are two feeding tubes. The big hole feeding tube results in less overrun, while the small hole feeding tube provides higher overrun. Install the feeding tube with a side that has the hole facing downward. If the mixture is too thick, it's better to use the big hole feeding tube for better filling of the mixture into the cylinder. Install the agitator blade. Place the front drip pan in its designated position. Insert the internal drip tray. Making ice cream. Turn on the power switch. Pour ice cream mixture into hopper. The mixture should exceed the mix low sensor. Press the wash button and let the machine run in wash mode for three minutes to fill the mixture into the cylinder. Drain out some liquid and refill to hopper. After one minute, turn machine in off mode. Turn on pre-cooling. Pre-cooling use for keep top tank cold. Turn on refrigeration. The machine will start cooling automatically. When the display reaches 100%, it means the ice cream is ready to serve. Pulling the handle can dispense the ice cream. Cleaning. Turn off pre-cooling. Turn off refrigeration. Press defrosting button to heat the cylinder. 
Defrosting take five mins and will stop automatically. Remove the agitator blade. Remove the feeding tube. Press wash button. Pull the handle to drain out all the mixture. Pour water into hopper. Drain out all the liquid. Pour water again and repeat the process until the drained water is clear. Cleaning the hopper. Drain all remaining liquid. Press off button. Turn off the power switch. Wipe clean the hoppers. Loosen the four dispensing door screws. Remove the dispensing door. Remove the beater, beater shaft, and gasket. Disassemble the dispensing door. Remove the three handles. Pull out three draw valves. Remove the caps. Remove all the O-rings from the draw valves and clean all the dispensing door parts. Remove the beater gasket from the shaft. Pull out the beater blades. Clean the cylinder. Take out the drip pan and clean it. Remove the internal drip tray and clean it. Hardness setting. Press and hold the up button for three seconds. Then press the up or down button to adjust the hardness level. The hardness level ranges from one to 20, with level one being the hardest and level 20 being the softest. Standby. Press the standby button to switch the machine to standby mode, keeping the mixture fresh overnight. 